for making this zombie, you will need a size 3 to 3.5 sizes of yarn. And you will also need to cut a small pieces of cardboard for the necktie. And I use 3.5 millimeter crochet hook. Now let's start first by making this shoe and the pants. Do a magic ring. Chain and do 8 single crochet inside the ring. Once you made 8 single crochet inside the ring, for round 2, do a single crochet in the first. And increase in the next stitch. Repeat for 12 stitches around. For round 3 and 4, single crochet each round for 12 stitches. After the fourth round, cut the yarn. Insert your darning needle in the second chain and then insert to that last stitch back loop only and then hide inside the stitches. For round 5, take your blue yarn and insert in the back loop only. Make a chain and then do another single crochet on that same stitch. Single crochet in the next. Do a single crochet. 12 stitches around Then for round 6 to 9, just single crochet spiral for 12 stitches. After the 9 round, cut the yarn and then do the same thing. Insert in the second chain and then insert the tail in that back loop stitch on the last and then hide inside the stitches for the left side of the feet just repeat round one to six and then cut the yarn And then we continue for the left side for round 7 insert the green yarn in the back loop only make a chain and then insert in the next back loop only stitch and make a single crochet and after that we'll do a decrease in the next Back loop only. That's our two, three, and then four, five. 
five. And then six. So we have six decrees for round seven. And then for round eight to nine, do a single crochet each for six stitches. Once done with the round 9, cut the yarn, pull up this tail, and do the same thing. Hide inside the stitches. And then take your blue yarn again, insert in that first chain or first stitch, do a chain, and for this time we will do a increase in each. That's our first single crochet, and then one more single crochet in that same stitch. And then in the next, make a two single crochet in that same stitch or increase and increase each of the chain for 12 stitches around Once you have 12 stitches, we will connect to that second leg and do a single crochet. And single crochet around until, to the, until you will reach to the stitch marker. Once you reach to the stitch marker, you will have 24 stitches. And then for round 11 to 13, do a single crochet each around for 24 stitches. Once done with round 13, cut the yarn, then again insert in that second chain, and then insert on that last stitch in the back loop, and then hide inside the stitches.
for making the head do a magic ring chain and do 10 single crochet inside the ring once you've made 10 single crochet pull the tail and then for round two increase each of the stitches or two single crochet each for 20 stitches around for round three single crochet in the first stitch and then increase in the next repeat around for 30 stitches and then for round four to eight do a single crochet each round for 30 stitches After the round 8, remove the stitch marker and do a single crochet. And then chain 1. Chain 1 does not count as a stitch. Single crochet in that first and then mark it. And then single crochet in the following 21 chains. And then after that, you still have 22, chain 1, and then go back to a single crochet of 22. And then when you reach to the stitch marker, chain 1, and then do one more, one more row of 22. And then chain 8, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And connect to this stitch marker. Do a single crochet. And then mark it. And then do a decrease in the next. That's one decrease, single crochet decrease. two single crochet in the next and decrease in the next three single crochet decrease four single crochet decrease five single crochet decrease six single crochet decrease seven single crochet and decrease on that chain here it's eight single crochet in the next and decrease in the next that's nine and then single crochet and decrease so we have then single crochet decreases And then next round single crochet decrease six times 
and then in the last stitch you will have one decrease Now for this round, make a single crochet each for 2 rounds of 13 single crochet stitches. Once done, cut the yarn and then hide inside the stitches. Now take your brown yarn, insert and make a chain. And another single crochet on that same stitch where you did the chain. And then increase in the next chain, in the next stitch. Single crochet in the next and increase or two single crochet in the next. Repeat for um, four times so you will have six times of single crochet increase and when you reach to that last stitch you will have one single crochet Now for this round, do a single crochet each for 19 stitches. Once you made 19 single crochet stitches, for this round, single crochet in the next 2 stitches. This is 1. And then single crochet in the next. Okay, and then increase in the next or two single crochet. Repeat six times. And then on the last stitch, you will have one single crochet. And 
and then single crochet each 25 stitches for four rounds and stand with the four rounds for this last round do a back loop only single crochet each of the stitch back loop and once you reach to that last stitch cut a long yarn leave a long tail and then we will sew the pants and the this jacket now grab your darning needle and then we transfer it on the front loop stitch where we did the back loop only on that last round transfer it there and then we will sew the pants on this side search right here and then find that remaining front loop stitch there and then insert on that next stitch on the pants For the arms, do a magic ring, chain, and six single crochet spiral for nine times. And then after nine times of six single crochet spiral, cut the yarn and then hide this extra tail on the middle. And then insert the green yarn on that back loop stitch, chain, and then chain slip stitch under and then slip stitch in the next chain chain of two one two slip stitch second chain from the hook and then repeat slip stitch under slip stitch in the next chain and then chain of two slip stitch second chain from the hook slip stitch under and then slip stitch in the next repeat for a total of five um, fingers
then hide the extra tail going to the top and then cut the yarn so when you remember we have a long tail on that brown yarn um, take it to the the arm side here and then sew the arms Now let's make the eye. This one is a magic ring, chain, and then eight single crochet. The first eye, and then this time we will do the eye number two. Magic ring, chain, and we will do a 12 single crochet inside the ring. Once you have 12 single crochet inside the ring, slip stitch on that first chain and then cut the yarn hide the tail inside the stitches and then cut it and then cut a long pieces of dark yarn and then we will sew it on the side of this tail here under all you need to do is just sew the 12 chains that we make back and forth And then for the teeth, teeth number one, slip knot, chain of two, and then half double crochet first chain, 
and then make a chain and cut the yarn and do the same thing on the teeth number two do a slip knot chain of three and half double crochet in the next two chain and then chain and cut the yarn I've got dreams. 